Let's Play! Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 1 Blind. After that mess, we can just go. Finally, head on our journey that we've waited so long to get on with. And we have some sharks and Sega hens. That's alright, because we have Bolt. And as far as I know, Bolt is effective against them, I think. Sega hen goes down one. Oh, snap, 102. 21, that's... Come on, Jarek, you can do better than this. You're a thief, for gosh sakes. I mean... Jump and press the circle button! It's that easy, man. That's what thieves are supposed to do. <laughs> Funny story. This morning, for some reason, um... Well, I was actually watching a Let's Play of Sly Cooper 1. And I just, I've always loved Bentley's voice, you know. Sly, you have to do this! And I've just loved it, and so all the morning I was saying it, you know, speaking in that voice, because I talk to myself when I'm alone. And, um, all of a sudden at school we were talking about when we went to this, my friend wanted to go to a Sailor Moon panel at a convention. And so I, I tagged along just because, you know, it was something. And there was this one girl in the front row who just wouldn't stop talking about, oh, this, these facts and stuff. And she was just annoying, so then we had to describe it for, to our other friend who never, who didn't come with us. And I was like, that I used the Bentley voice, and I was like, Did you know that in episode 42 of Sailor Moon, Usagi actually has a different voice actress? And you know what? And, and I guess my kind of achievement for the day was, I, I actually used my Bentley voice that I was practicing. So, oh, we can't go in there. I did look on a map before we went, because uh, I, knew it, I knew I'd need... Hey, a privateer. Privateer! It's fun to say it. <laughs> Uh, but I think he's no match for us. Nope. And returning from my old Let's Plays is me having a, a can of something to drink beside me. This time it is Mountain Dew Voltage. The, the blue... Or, yes, the blue Mountain Dew from the different Mountain Dew flavors. Ooh, Cobras. Um, I, I love these new Mountain Dew flavors that they have. I'm not sure if it's going on in the States, but up here in Canada they have it where it's like, there's four different flavors, but only one of them's gonna stay, so you have to find one and keep it. Oh, it's a little village. Let's go to the village. Or not, we could just not. That's, that's fine too. Oh boy, wolves. My favorite enemies in games. Although, like I said, not as bad as when- Oh, it- Oh! You were scared of us, weren't you? I mean, look at us, we're four buff manly men. You know, Brad, Fua, Tom, and Jarek, who can one-shot you guys, even though you're so fast, we only get one hit off, but we can still one-shot you guys. Boom! Bam! Except for, uh, Tom. He just utterly annihilates you because of his fists of fury. And we get some stuff and things and things and stuff. And let's go to the town. What is this place? This is... Elfheim. Oh, look, it's the love dudes. Please help our prince. Will do. First off, though, let's go raid all the crap you have. Let's see here. Any- there should be stronger weapons, am I right? Iron Nunchuck. You're better with your fists, though. Um, down... Up, no. Uh, Saber and a Mithril Sword. Ooh, Mithril Sword. I want two Mithril Swords, please. I know it's- Might seem like a waste of money, but I don't care. Um, so let's equip those quickly. Let's see- oh! I love watching when the stats go up. Okay, so broadsword to mithril sword to 32! Oh, yeah! Uh, battle axe, mithril sword to 37. Very nice. Uh, nothing. Smite, schmidt, schmitar to the saber. Alright. Sounds good. And now we'll sell our other old crap. Uh, yes. And yes. Eight gil for a rapier. That is really not a lot. Broadsword, ooh, at least I, at least these get us some money back. It's uh, quite nice to have. Actually, this Mountain Dew Voltage is really good. I'm surprised. I'm not normally one who experiments with his choice of, um, choice of pop. But that's really good, actually. Ah, uh, now we need some armor. Oh, wait, wait, is this in this version? Rest in peace. May Link rest in peace. <laughs> It's- I- I love that they kept it in in this version, but I think in, like, another remake, they- they changed it. Like, on a Nintendo version of it, they changed it out to be the hero from Dragon Quest, and that's just- that's funny. I wandered into an ancient castle, but no one was there, so I ran out of that sp- oh, interesting. Remember, in every JRPG, 
everything the townspeople say is true. If the prince is not awakened, there will be no elf king, and then evil force of dark elves will conquer us. Oh, that's not good. So where's the uh, others? There's the shop way down here. Oh, you look different. Are you a special character? I'm a prophet. The vision will come to me eventually. I shall wait. Well, you're not a very good prophet then, it seems. Now, let's see here. Ooh, helmets. We can finally get these. Get one helmet. Get three leather caps for the rest of them. Iron shield. Sure, why not? Or wait. Copper armlet. Okay, no, they... There's nothing. Um, okay. Sounds good. All stuff that's uh, gonna help us, hopefully. I was wondering why those slots weren't ever being filled. Uh, helmet, leather cap. What, what, what does that do exactly? Let's see here. If I remove it, I actually want to see the stat gain to know. Defense goes up by one point, better than nothing. Uh, defense goes up by... not well, eva well, he never was an evasive person, so... And, uh, okay, sounds good. Every little stat helps. Actually, I've been playing Final Fantasy X, and that's one where every little stat helps, that's for sure. Uh, is this, this place looks special. Is this something I should know of? Oh, it's just a cathedral. Cool. Sounds awesome. Okay, so the inn. Let's grab some black magic here. <laughs> that was... I'm not gonna go there. Fire 2? Uh, the thousand, ooh. Bolt 2. I think I'll just take Bolt 2 for now. Um, just because I only I really need one of them. and a, I don't know, it just feels like there's more need for electricity than there is a need for like fire right now I could be wrong um cure two that's important dia to on undead foes interesting heal oh that sounds awesome I want something like that wait well I don't have enough money well then poop I'll come back for that after well I know we have to go to the dark elf's cave now cuz that's uh I know that. Wait, is this another white magic place? Seriously, why is there two? Isuna, poison. Drives foes away in fear. Ice damage, cures mute. Is Isuna only... Oh, and... Wait. They can... Oh, I see. White knight... Oh. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um, yeah, then there's another dark magic place. Let's see this one. Black magic. Um, sleep to haste, muddle, and ice. Interest. Why is ice more expensive than... I don't know. I don't... I really don't know. Um, okay. So, let's look for this dark elf's cave. Or maybe we have to go to the king first. It's normally a good, good, good idea. Um... And, oh boy. How come these castles always have to be so- Oh, hey, there's someone dead here. Astos cast a curse on our prince five years ago. Caused him to fall into deep slumber. What can lift this curse? Zuz. Okay. Okay. Can you get out of the way? Nope, that's cool. Wait, are you blocking it for a reason? Uh, cast a curse on our prince and empty all the castle. Treasure vaults! The fiend! Who would do such a thing? <laughs> Treasure vaults! Well, I mean, kind of your fault for leaving all the treasures just lying around. I mean, anybody could be kleptomaniac enough to just want to steal that. Not saying anyone in particular, really, but, you know. Okay, well, there's nothing here. Well, let's look for this Dark Elf Cave. I think it's the south. I think. I think. But first off, random encounters with enemies that will brutally screw us up. Oh, wolves. Oh, sweet, I can attack them all? Oh, yes, that's what I wanted. I wanted one like, I wanted a big one. That's awesome. That's good. This makes me happy. I finally get multicast. That's what I want. It's taking a long time to hit. Let's see this. Bolt 2. Oh, boy, look at them effects. Oh, boy, that makes me so happy. Punch that wolf, Tom. Punch it. And there's one left. Can't survive. That was awesome. That was, that was really, oh, oh, god, yes. Um, okay. That will be helpful. 
Especially in the near future, because I know lots of enemy packs are a thing. How much do we have for this? It'll, oh, we have... Not, oh, wow, we have lots of casts of it, too. Which is awesome! I'm just gonna celebrate with another sip of Mountain Dew Voltage. This part brought to you in part by Mountain Dew Voltage. It's the voltagest drink you'll ever have. Actually, it's not. I won't say that, because... Whenever I have to fill out one of those, um... Things that let me monetize this video. It's like, does this video contain a paid advertisement? That's not a paid advertisement. That's just a, uh... An ad advertisement, I, I guess, maybe? Okay. Um... This place looks like the opening to possibly a big area. Wolves. I think we could just punch them ourselves. So far, we're doing pretty good. The Peninsula Power Grinding was useful. Quite useful, yes. Four hits. Oh, yeah, baby. You know, it's funny. I was discussing with my friend about the fact that I'm doing this Let's Play. He doesn't watch my videos, but he knows I'm doing this one. And he said, you know, he said he couldn't, he wouldn't be able to do a Let's Play or even a playthrough of a game like this because of the fact that it's really archaic. But the more I'm playing this, like, can you imagine playing this back in, back on the NES? Like, oh, nice. Like, just, just thinking about that makes me kind of like, wow, this game was, when they, you know, I know they always say, like, Final Fantasy was revolutionary, it brought Squeenix out of, well, not squ well, Square back then, out of the fact that it, you know, out of, uh, blah, like, they were going to be bankrupt. And I, I never really thought of it until, like, now that the reason for that is this game is really good. Oh, preemptive strike on the ogre. Let's magic him, bro. Ice, ice, baby. And yes. Oh yeah, 23. How much? Well, at least we know that the damage... Four hits, bro! Tom, calm your tits, bro! You just say they flying off the handle. Fo shizzle! <laughs> I'm so white. I love it. I love being hilariously white. You know, I think we could just kill these guys by just ransacking them like this. Yeah. What game introduced the active battle system, I wonder? They had it in 3, I know, because of the fact... Well, maybe the DS version added that. I'm not sure. That's a, that's a question that I want to actually learn the answer to. Okay, so before we go into the Dark Elf Cave, once I find it, because I'm guessing that's what it is, I think I've read somewhere about this being a thing. And not like Final Fantasy IV, which I also recently watched the Let's Play of the PSP version. Super Gaming Brothers, they're awesome. Watch them, please, for me. Um, also, Final Fantasy II is on disc here. Well, not really on disc, considering it's... Oh no, Poison, I should've got a Suna. I got Andotes, though. Um, not really on disc, but you know what I mean. It's, it, it's on this download, so... I might do that next, actually, you know? I wanna, I wanna know the origins of Johnny Young Furion. Um... I've never played Dissidia. That's something that bothered me. It's like, one of the reasons I kinda wanna Vita is to play also all the, uh, PSP games that I never, ever got to even touch because of the fact that it was just, I've never able to. Cause I never got a PSP, cause it kinda was the more expensive system. And let's use a tent, why not? It was always more expensive than the DS, and I got a DS, uh... I remember, it was it was the year with the Mario Kart Red DS. And I wanted that. And I got it! But it didn't come with Mario Kart. The the little fold-out thing, like, it just came out with a little piece of paper that had Mario Kart with it. And it didn't have it. So I we had to go back and ask for a new copy of it. Which I did, and I got it. Um... I also got Nintendogs. I thought that was the dopest shit back then. Like, the like I just thought that was so cool. And I mean, think about it now. It's like people are like, oh, Nintendogs. Needless cash-ins. But that was such a simpler time back then. Where there were the, 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 there was no idea of needless cash-ins. It was just fun games. And I honestly miss that. Like, for example, today, Nintendo revealed A Link to the Past 2. And everybody's all like... A link to the past too. Needless cashing on nostalgia, Nintendo. And I'm like, no. Can't we just have fun? Also, there was that castle there. It's like, please. I mean, yeah, Mario Golf, you know, looks kind of lackluster like Mario Tennis was. And it's like, 
But, like, I mean, we don't have to be so rude about games and stuff, and I'm guessing this is where I go, the Wreck Castle, am I, am I right? Did I assume right? Did I not make an ass out of you and me? Oh, the Western Keep. Key! That's a uh, bat noise. Okay. Okie dokie. Pretty funky music. White boy. The door is locked with the mystic key. Well, shoot. There's no random encounters. So, I guess there's nothing here. Yeah, I'm guessing we'll come back with the mystic key then. Um, okay. So, I'm lost. That's fun. Wolves! I think uh, I'm gonna call this a part right away. Maybe I will look at a map. Because I found a map online, which I will look at in between now and then. So, I guess I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy 1 Blind. Ciao! Brought to you in part by Mountain Dew Voltage. It's the voltagest you've ever drank. <sighs> That's good. See you guys next time. Ciao.